As each hour slipped by, family members hoped to reach some sort of closure after their loss. The group who had gathered by the river bank grew increasingly frustrated as the Coast Guard, police, nor BDF arrived to begin the search. Bert Ramos, a resident of the village, is one of the many who waited anxiously for help from authorities today. Mm. I personally call 3.30 and we don't get no assistance until yesterday evening about 6 o'clock. The first boat come with two Coast Guard officers and we explain the situation to them. We take them out to the location. I wasn't there but um, a tag left to identify the area. And so um, I went along with the Coast Guard and some other friends that was out here and we do a search until about 7 o'clock last night. I mean, BDF is right over there. Coast Guard is not too far away. We have police. I mean, Coast Guard is saying that the police never make an official report to them. That's why they haven't sent out their divers. So now um, the chair lady just called the um, inspector in charge and asked him, about the situation, the inspector in charge said that, well, it's under control and pretty soon they'll expect some divers to be out here um, this, uh, this afternoon, sometime this afternoon. Well, we are waiting, we don't know how long that will take. So we're really sad, you know, the village lost a very nice person. I know since I came into the village and meet the man, he's a nice person. Um, he always expressed his feeling. In fact, he was at the meeting on Sunday and everything, you know, so it's a very big loss for the village, you know. And assist. Anybody who want to come out and assist, we'd I really appreciate it because um, it's a loved one and it's a nice, he's a nice person. A team from the Coast Guard arrived around 3 in the afternoon, conducted dives in the area for a little over an hour and left saying they would return tomorrow. Meanwhile, Franklin's body is still missing. The men who had gathered today by the riverbank also called it a day late this evening, but are now asking for assistance. The Lalekal for Love News.